All over the world, the traveller said, in my peregrinations I've been. And there's nothing remarkable, living or dead, but these eyes of mine have seen from the land of the ape and the marmoset to the lands of the Philippine. Said the other, I lay you an even bet you are never in Farinaline. I've hunted in woods near Seringapatam and sailed in the polar seas. I fished for a week in the Gulf of Siam and lunched on the Chersonese. I've lived in the valleys of fair Kashmir under Himalay's snowy ridge. The other impatiently said, see here, we ever at Laffin's Bridge. I've lived in the land where tobacco is grown, in the suburbs of Santiago. And I spent two years in Sierra Leone and one in Del Fuego. I walked across Panama all in a day. Ah, me, but the road was rocky. The other replied, will you kindly say we ever at horse and jockey? I'd borne my part in a savage fray when I got this wound from Alaska. We were bound just then from Mandalay for the island of Madagascar. Ah, the sun never tired of shining there, and the trees canaries sang in. What are that, said the other, should I have a pair, and there's lots of them over in Drangan. And I've hunted the tigers in Turkestan, in Australia the kangaroos. And I lived six months as a medicine man to a tribe of the Kathmandu's. And I've stood on the scene of Olympic Games, where the Grecians show their paces. The other replied, now tell me, James, were you ever at feathered races? Don't talk of your hunting in Yucatan or your fishing off St. Helena. I'd rather see young fellas hunting the ran in the hedges of Tubernahina. No doubt the scenes of a Swiss canton have a passable sort of charm, but give me a sunset on Schlievenaman from the road at Hackett's farm, and I'd rather be strolling along the quay and watching the river flow than growing tea with the cute Chinese or mining in Mexico. And I wouldn't much care for Sierra Leone if I hadn't seen killing all, and the man that was never in Mullinahone shouldn't say he had travelled at all.